I dropped doing a lot of sports, but quickly I turned into cross-country skiing and biathlon, which has been my main way of living life for the last 28 years, I guess. Very few of the athletes start out of trail runners. It actually sucks in the best talents from other sports. My first sport where I was competing was radio orienteering. For me, my first sport is chemo. I ran track, but trail is where my heart is at now. I think something about trail runners is that we often don't identify as just trail runners, but more just lovers of the outdoors. To be honest, I was a little intimidated by the Golden Series at first. I never won a Golden Trail Series race before. It really is open who can win today. Uh, it's always good to win at home. We have the two weapons to win everything. This is the head-to-head -head we've been waiting for. If you don't know what trail running is and you think it's like running, <laughs> you're miles off. At the moment, on the overall ranking, I'm 11th, which is a tricky spot. Having two athletes at the final, this is crucial to us as a brand. It shows credibility. One of the teams that's been really impressive this season has been Team Matrix. Just behind Salomon, I think we, we can be the second big team of the world. I think it's really hard to see the limit. It's amazing. How can you fuck up your body if you don't? listen to it really. All you see is the the glorious finish line shot of winning or passing or the epicness of it, but there's so much more humanity in trail running and I think that's the real reason we all love it. As many people say, like running is the most simple sport in the world, but when you connect that with the race, then it gets way more complex. Oh my gosh, like if I can't finish the race at this point, like I'm gonna be so mad. Oh, no, I have a lot of new scars. You need to take something home from, from such a race. <laughs> <laughs>